8.20. Their bus don't come until um, 8.25. And I have an appointment at 9. 30 minutes away and I need to put gas. So. Good morning. Good morning. That little black one over there have an appointment at 9. It gotta be done. So, yeah. So I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Anna, you're gonna have a good day today? Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna have a good day, right? Yes, wait, let me tell Jason's friend something. Let me tell Jason's friend something. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs> good morning. I got a slipping appointment at 9 o'clock. It's 8. It's 8. 25. Hello. Their bus don't come. No, it's 8. So I'm over here worrying that I'm late and the psychologist just called me and said that she's going to be 40 minutes late and I was like thank you Jesus because I needed that little um, extra so I went and got me some hot stuff to drink in my tummy tummy because yeah I was getting a little anxious getting a little anxious and and I suffer from anxiety so I didn't want to have an anxiety attack out here so I'm glad that she called and you know calm me down and I hate to be late hate to be late one of my worst pet peeves I don't know who would schedule someone with children at nine o'clock in the morning who would do that knowing that I have to put the older kids on the bus seriously so um yeah, I'm going to put my thing in, um, the address in my GPS and get the rolling and get out of here. So I'll catch up with you guys once I'm there. Bye. So we're here at the appointment. And because she's running late, um, we're like sitting out on the side of the road waiting. Mommy? I don't know what the heck. I need to find something for him to eat for breakfast because by the time I drop him off at school, Breakfast will be over, so I need to go get him breakfast. Look, buddy. Say good morning. Say good morning to you. Good morning to you. Good morning, little Jack. Good morning to you. late we're not late well technically well your appointment was for nine o'clock and then the psychologist called and said that she'll be a couple minutes late so we're not late we're early this cafe's good mommy mommy yes so I don't have anything planned for today. Let me let me check my planner. I don't have anything planned for today. Um, I have a lot. I need to do a what's in my purse video because I have a lot of crap. So let's go to September. Yeah, I don't have a lot planned for today. So today is Wednesday. There's an appointment, exercise, Mommy. kids laundry, water, T25, read my Bible, vlog, edit, my appointment for my doctor at 1, and then dinner, and my meds. That's it? So that's about it for today. So I don't have a lot planned. I wanted to squeeze some more stuff in. She has a lot of work at home. Mommy! Because I have something to do. Yeah. Your face is dirty. Ah, that. You don't want a close up of your face. All, uh, he has allergies, so his nose is like constantly running. 
lot. And as you can see, my makeup is starting to sweat. My, not sweat, melt off my face because it's like, it's not hot, but because I was running around. <sighs> yeah. So, and then this pants is like falling off of me. Like, as you that can see, like it's like ridiculously big. So, it's falling off of me. And then I have my, my leg, so I have tendonitis in the toe. So, <laughs> I'm walking around like this. <laughs> yeah, not, not fun. Not fun at all, but yeah, I'm gone. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so Jason is in his um in the the room with the psychologist, and um I'm gonna be out here for a couple minutes. They're gonna ask him some questions, and um yeah. Say hi, Bookie. So we're waiting. And she was extremely late. So. Mm -hmm. Quiet, buddy. Say hi. Want to say hi? Say hi. Hi. What's your name? Jackson. Jackson. What do you like to do, Jackson? Color. Color. He wants my phone to go color, so I'll catch up with you guys later. So we are coming back on from. Um, Jason, you got your bat on. Put your bat on. Oh, okay. So we are coming back from his appointment. Everything went good. Um, now I got to get him something to eat because he hasn't had breakfast and it's 11.19 and I have to drop him off at school. His lunch is at 1.19, so I can't wait that long for him to have something in his stomach. So I'm gonna stop at McDonald's and get him a McChicken and um, some water, something. Um, so he can have something in his tummy before I drop him off at school. And then after that, I need to go home I have I have an appointment at one o'clock, so let me see what I can squeeze in before um, I go. So let me go, cause I'm still driving. So I'll talk to you guys later. JJ is eating his mac chicken over there. <laughs> I had to get him something to eat, and it's let me show you guys. It's 11:45. I'm have an appointment at 1 p.m. I keep saying that, but and then I have to go drop him off at school. So we're gonna eat our McChicken. But it's the only thing I can afford on the run. It's a dollar. One dollar. So it's not like I eat like this every day, guys. I don't eat like this every day. But I haven't had breakfast and it's lunchtime, so yeah. Mmm. Chicken. Um, of course. Lunch only cost me three dollars and eighteen cents because we're drinking water. <laughs> so, um, yeah, three dollars and eighteen cents for lunch. And he's gonna have lunch at school, but it, it's lunch time is at one eighteen, so that's too long. And then Jackson, so I'm gonna finish eat, get his butt to school. And on to my appointment. Hopefully, I can go to the grocery store and pick up dinner because I didn't take anything out. So I need to go to the grocery store and pick up dinner. I don't even know what for dinner or uh, what to cook. But anyways, to the loop. It's 12.30. Mommy? I dropped this off at school at 12. I went to the bank. Um, paid my phone bill and my cable bill which was $400 in total, $405 in total, which makes me realize that I need to switch carrier because $400 a month on foolishness, we need to switch because that's foolishness. Right, Gio? Foolishness. Say foolishness. Say foolishness. <laughs> yeah, so I might switch carrier. But right now I'm at my doctor's appointment. My foot is killing me. That big old thing on there is. Do chair. Me. Gosh. Oh, do yeah. chair. So, yeah. That's it for right now. Hi, we can make bubbles. Look. For a limited time, Bubble. 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 Bub
free gutters with every roof replacement. Call now, 800. So my husband and I are having a discussion and I asked him to drive me to Micro Center and um, he's like, well, I'll go if you drive. That defeats the purpose. I only want you to go because I want you to drive. He's like, well, you can take your car because I only drive small cars. Something about me driving big cars that scares me. I am a weird driver and I drive without my shoes on so I don't know if anybody else does that if you do comment below and let me know why you drive without your shoes on but that's another video why I drive with Giovanni Jackson why are you so loud my, don't mind my husband funny looking toes look at them toes Stop. That's some part of where we live. I don't drive because the people them them drive like them not make sense. I'm a I can't bother. I can't be bothered with none drivers. So, honey, say bye. Oh, someone is annoyed. Why can't my house ever calm down? Just calm down. I don't know why. I don't like. Ah! I don't like calming down. It's too quiet. Uh, it's 6.30 and I still haven't put dinner on the fire. Oh, it? <laughs> but it's 4 in the morning and I'm at work. Uh -oh. You see, he likes to throw the fact that he goes to work and provide. That's why it's not good to be a stay-at-home mom because when they have to do anything, they throw it in your face. I can't wait Mommy, until... Mom. I'm able to provide and be an equal provider for this family because then I won't have people throw stuff in my face. Bye! Alright, you're loud for no reason. Wait, let me say that. Bye. Wait, one more thing. Wait. Jordan is never in the video. Jordan, you want to say bye? Bye. Bye bye. He never wants to be a part of the videos. Alright, I'll see you guys tomorrow.